cool. So basically this tutorial I'm going to show you how to um, set up a shadow pass to export into After Effects. Um, so first thing, just have your object where whatever it is, make it ground plane. Uh, move that to just by pressing M to layer two. I'm just gonna uh, start this way. And um, once you have that done, go into the. Uh, sorry, I have to select this first. Uh, make sure you have your lighting all set up. I just want it to be a little bit more defined than this. And then turn cycles render on. You can do that before this. I just forgot. And uh, then basically just create a new render layer. Well, you, you already have one, but just name this one cube. Okay. Um, have that on the first one and so you want it the scene on layer one and the layer on layer one okay and uh, then create a new pass call this shadow a o and we'll get to that later I'm just gonna uncheck it for now because if you have both of them checked at the same time and render both them out at the same time it's going to be kind of like a different situation um, so basically have your cube just render that out okay and uh, it will be saved wherever you want as long as you make sure to set up where you want to save it render out the video or the still image doesn't matter if you're going to do still then you can just press F3 and it will save in whatever file you want but say preferably save it in a uh, folder called cube. Okay, now once you're done saving that, uncheck the cube uh, layer and go to the shadow AO. Uh, go to the pass passes AO shadow. Um, and just basically. Uh, select both these and select the second one on the layer uh, and then I will have to go into the compositor for a second but it won't it won't like it's not difficult at all if you're not good with the nodes uh, don't worry about it because it's really simple so change this from cube to shadow and uh, plug the shadow into the image then just render that and it doesn't it looks just like normal right now but when the compositing is done watch this it's gonna turn all white except for the shadow see there you go and that is basically the uh, shadow pass thing that you want um, and then you would just take those two into After Effects and there's plenty of tutorials on compositing once you have the layers but I just wanted to show you how to you know uh, actually export them if you have any questions at all about this um, just leave them in the comment box below uh, I plan to make more tutorials because I haven't really been making a ton check out my other channel my main one where I actually post videos often and um, just uh, if you want to request a tutorial, go ahead, thumbs this up, subscribe, and uh, I'll see you in the next tutorial.